What's up guys, it's boy Napstar and we are in my new sneaker room that I'm going to be showing you guys in a minute. So with all that said, I just want to say, it's been a terrible couple of days for us black people, man. You know what I mean? Like, racism is real and it's been going on for far too long, man. You know what I mean? Like, it, it's terrible. We're all human beings, no matter the color of our skin. You know what I mean? So, um, I'm just really heartbroken. You know, seeing all these videos of how, you know, the late George Floyd died. He was a human being, no matter the circumstances or situation. So with all that said, man, like, um, we need to stand up as a nation and, you know, like, black crime has to stop, man. You know what I mean? So with all that said, uh, let's jump in the video. guys so welcome back and as you guys can see i'm starting off with what you guys see on my feet right now which are my white bed slippers that goes with my theme for this room so you guys see what i got on feet let's start it off with what we got right here which is a shelf that was built by my daughter and i got a few of my hats on here can't hold all of them but I put out some that I like the most out of all in my collection. So first, starting off, as you guys can see, we got the Supreme hat right there. Uh, we got my Captain America uh, NBA uh, championship hat uh, because your boy is in Canada. So you already know we got to represent because we the North, you know what I mean? So moving on downwards, we got uh, just a regular Nike ear hat right there. We got a Super Mario cap right here. And uh, my first uh, custom cap that I've ever done, which is my uh, YouTube name, which is Napstar TV, as you guys can see right there. We got the old uh, TV with the nap and star, which is the A and the P which represent Napstar, and then we got the TV going on right there. To the left of that, we got my PlayStation cap right here, which is was a gift from my wife. And if we move down, we got some uh, Los Angeles Lakers cap right here. Got this uh, for your boy. You know what I mean? The late, great Kobe. So rest in peace, Kobe. Gone too soon, buddy. You know what I mean? But hey, you know... You're still with us. And also here we got another piece uh, as you guys can see right here. That is my other custom cap which you can see my new logo uh, going on right here. Which is the same Napstar but is different from what we have above. And moving on we got uh, some uh, Chicago Bulls uh, cap right here. Reckless Los Angeles Astro World uh, New York Yankee some uh, uh, Chicago Bulls, some Air Jordan right here, uh, just a random piece that I pick up because I thought it looked good, also another random piece that I pick up, you know, uh, oh my god, <laughs> as you guys can see, they're all dead stock, also got uh, another Supreme Cap right there, so that is what we got for my uh, cap stand thus far. At the door, we got some extra slides, so if somebody comes down here, uh, you got to take your shoes off. Can't come in here with your shoes, so we got some slides there, so if you want to put those on, it's cool. Right here, we got my shelf, as you guys can see, with some of my uh, sneakers on here, which you guys have seen in my Instagram posts a lot. I uh, might just go through them quickly with you. Got some Vans, some BYWs, Off-White Air Jordan 1. Air Jordan, Marvin the Martian, got some more Vans, uh, Kyrie Low 2, What the Colorway, Air Jordan 4, Levi's, some Nike uh, Flight Zoom, Nike Epic React, 
uh, some Odell Beckham right here, Nike Air Force One um, time capsules. I totally don't remember what these are, but uh, you guys can see. Uh, pretty dope sneaker. Um, Kanye's 380 Alien. Shutter Backboard Air John 1 Lows. Uh, Nike um, Air Force Ones. Uh, Giannis Atenta Campo. Uh, Cactus Flea Market. Uh, Vapor Max. Uh, LeBron Medicine Ball right here. Some custom Sean Witherspoon. Some more of your boy Giannis Atenta Campo to come into America. Love the shoe very much. Down here, we got some random shoes. We got some Adidas. Uh, some Adidas, some Nike, some Fear of Gods, and uh, that's basically it. Um, shoes down here, as you guys can see, most of them I have not rocked yet, but in the future, I will, and I will make some videos of those. Moving on to the left, we got my sentimental stand right here, which is another piece that I made with my daughter. She is super cool. I love doing these uh, projects with her because she is i don't know she's just freaking amazing you know she always takes the time to work with me and i love that we get to spend time together in this time which you know we can't go out or whatever so we we tend to make a whole bunch of projects and uh really enjoy every moment so starting off we got uh my chinese buddha right here which was a gift from a client of mine because as you guys know my wife and i we own our own company so that was a gift from a client of mine. We got a uh, Pikachu that I stole from my bathroom. Uh, it's probably from my son or my grandson. I don't know who it is, but I freaking stole it because it looks cool. So uh, they might see this video and come back for it, which will never happen because I got cameras in my room. So anyways, moving on, we got the 1957 Bel Air right here. As you guys can see, love this piece very much in the corner peeking out we got uh eminem right there uh just something that i randomly pick up uh we got a light here from the dollar store just you know something that you looked unique so i was like all right let me grab this moving on to the second shelf we got some marvel uh bobblehead toys you know what i mean courtesy of the wife courtesy of the wife and my latest pickup as you guys can see the super mother super mario brothers right there uh, to the left of that, we got a lava lamp uh, inside here. More bobblehead Star Wars edition going on right there. We got some more Star Wars stuff. We got some uh, random um, camouflage uh, watch that you guys can see right there. We got my trophy that I got in 2008 for uh, taking part in automotive uh, technician course. Uh, we got a cup right here that I never used from my wife. Uh, the price is even still on it, but you know, it's cool. And, uh, like I said, my sentimental, uh, stand. So it got a whole bunch of random sentimental stuff. We got, a uh, Appleton, uh, whiskey bottle that I got from my mother-in-law. And here we got my Napstar light, as you guys can see, just to add a little bit of pop to the shelf right here. We got my Super Mario mcdonald's <laughs> happy meal box which is a year old i got this for my grandson i bought him the happy meal and i saw this box and i was like yo i'm still in this so i took the, his food out and i stole the box and it's still here in my possession which will be for a long time and one day i'll tell him the story when he's old enough and see his reaction uh right here we got some whiskey some royal crown canadian whiskey you know what i mean just for keepsake right here uh to the left of that we got an xbox controller which was custom made by my son for my birthday and i think it looks really dope love this piece very much and i can't thank him enough for making something like this for me very very sentimental uh, towards my heart and will always have that in my collection to the left of that we got an old coca-cola uh it, you can actually drink it but i'm not it's just for aesthetics just for souvenir purpose and right here as you guys can see we got the supreme grinch right there 
uh, as you guys can see on the top we got supreme writing and it is made from a bulb that my son painted for me for christmas another dope piece and happy 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 that he does these stuff because i would rather these pieces than to go to the store and buy something here you guys can see i got my shoe uh two shoecases right here with just a couple of my most prized possession which is my og off right presto my travis scott some more travis scott uh my uh custom toy story air max and also my wife's pair moving over we got the mars yard 2.1 uh, 1.0, my bad. <laughs> As you guys can see, it looks very old. I can't even wear the shoe. The color is fading, everything. To the bottom of that, we got the OG uh, Nike Sakai Waffle in the first colorway. And if we move up top, we got my latest pickup, the Off-White Air Jordan right there, which I took the um, Lace Agless off because I am not a fan of Lace Agless. They just look big and bulky if it was something like this that's on the travis scott i would have kept it but it's too big and i just don't like it up here we got my woody teddy bear and his hat is right there right here we just got a random light to kind of give me some brightness as my professional lights are not here yet so i gotta be working with something like that here we got my desk showed you my camera before this is my wireless insignia uh, headset that is connected to my monitor that I use for uh, editing my videos, which is a 27 inch curve monitor. We'll be going for a super ultra wide in the future. But for now, this does the job. If we move upwards, get back to you guys in a second. Upward, we got uh, some fake uh, <laughs> Ikea plans. And in between that, we got a picture of me and my wife back in Jamaica. Uh, above that, we got another um, project from my son, which was a artwork slash painting thing that he did for me. And I had to keep it in my room or else he would kill me. So it is out there, uh, followed by another uh, Ikea plant. So balancing out the whole shelf thing right there. Moving on. We got uh, Google right here, as you guys can see. Uh, Bluetooth speaker, just in case I want to connect my phone or something. You know, we have that right here. My Lenovo uh, laptop, which I use to edit my videos in 4K or 1080p, whichever I see suitable for me. And my desk, as you guys can see, is custom made by my daughter and I. So there's a good look at my desk and the theme for my room is white and stained wood as you guys see everywhere. My chair is a $100 Ikea chair. I just like this chair. I could have went more expensive, but I choose not to because this does the job that I want it to do. Uh, if we move left to left off the desk, we got another piece that um is done by me and my daughter which is my couch slash bed and as you guys can see got my dji um fly more combo uh hard case right here which you know uh got a few days ago my wife got me this new drone so i've been playing around with it so that's why the case is right here i've been flying it earlier so uh, that's why you see it sitting out here. We got some cushions right here, some extra pillows, some more pillows and a blanket because it does get chilly down here because it is the basement. If we go above the couch, you guys can see right here, got some artwork, which I did. So that's my cause piece right here. And we just got a Napstar piece with a million Napstars written all over. You guys might say I'm freaking uh, crazy for doing that. But hey, it's unusual and I like it. Over to the left of the couch, as you guys can see right here, we got an Ikea lamp with a globe smart light in there, which I can control from 
my phone or I could use Google which is right here as we are moving into this section right now we got my wireless charging with my Samsung S8 Plus right here old school uh, my PlayStation controllers my DJI controller and this little piece that I got right here my smart pen so if I tap this there you go <laughs> it's just something cool that I have I uh, just have it because it matches my uh, theme that I'm going to I got my uh, smartwatch right here on the smart and uh, under the not even smart but just your stand for your smartwatch and I got my DJI Mavic mini right here which is probably about five days old right here we got some artwork slash painting that I made just to um, extend the theme and if we move over to this way we have my 55 inch Samsung Smart TV which is a bit old uh, for the era that we're in right now but it does the job and it's just my basement I will eventually get a new TV uh, in the future but for now it's good if we move to the side of that you can see my PlayStation 2 right there uh, some accents light and also the stand that you guys can see right now is another piece that was custom made to go with the room uh, below the stand we got my Wilson NFL uh, ball right there and if we move closer you guys can see my shield TV right here my PlayStation 3 and and my classic Nintendo 64 brand spanking new never used before and right here you guys can see my PlayStation 4 slim and my 4k HDMI splitter so that I can switch through everything quickly without using my remote and switching towards my HDMI uh, switch right here we got three shelves as you guys can see the bottom shelf I got a cactus plant shout out to Travis Scott you know what I mean up here on the second shelf we got some of my physical games that I had and uh, PlayStation Lite and check this out if I turn it on it makes the original PlayStation sound also a gift from my son uh, pretty pretty dope gift I you know was very surprised when he got me that but uh, and he's so young he, he's like 10 years old so he knows I'm a huge PlayStation fan so thank you so much kiddo love you and the third shelf we got your boy Woody yes I got a lot of Woody uh, stuff as you guys can see huge Toy Story um, fan so we got Woody here Woody here again we got a PlayStation 3 uh, controller right here moving over to this side we got a few of my custom shoes and just some random shoes as you guys can see got my uh, Kobe off-white right here as you guys can see 24 on one side 8 on the other uh, got some uh, custom dip dyed uh, pure boost uh, Air Jordan Supreme uh, Jordan whatever you know some ultra blues back on black on black uh, my what the LeBron as you guys can see haven't worn these since I made them but that's okay uh, custom uh, daybreak and uh, some boots for if I'm going out with the wife and I want to dress elegant I can wear these or I can go for these which are my brand new desert Clarks because you know your boy Jamaican and if you're Jamaican you understand why you have to have a pair of this in your collection shout out to Vibes Cartel who made that shoes uh, go on the map even more and moving on we got my shelf right here as you guys can see we got a whole bunch of drinks uh, sodas everything you can think of uh, Gatorade Red Bull um, brisk we got some Palm Bay vodka soda waters you know Starbucks Frappuccino a little bit of everything so if you come down here and you're thirsty you can grab something to drink and also <clears throat> we got my table right here as you guys can see this is a very unique table if I can 
give you a view so you guys can see what that looks like it is pretty dope and it's one of my most favorite piece that i've made and as you guys can see it matches with the theme of everything we got three bottles in here uh my wife ate all the twizzlers guys so just letting you know uh we got some sweet right here which whenever my daughter comes in she tries to <laughs> sneak out uh some sweets from here but it's all right uh we got some uh spicy cheetos in here and uh we got uh i don't even know what this is i just freaking like it as you guys can see it's a vase and it's filled with purple liquid we got my air freshener right here and uh, moving on we got a uh a, just a table bedside table here which if I open this drawer, you're going to be hit with 1,000 wires, smart bulbs, uh, computer parts, everything like that, you know. Got my salt lamp right here, which is supposed to give you positive vibes and stuff like that, which my wife said. I don't know, man. I'm a guy. We don't, we don't, we don't go into details like that. I just think it looks cool, so I brought it down here. Uh, got the, the homie Mr. Minion right here chilling in front of the lamp. If we move up, you guys can see uh, artwork that I have right here. Uh, just something to add some pop to the wall. Also got a LED light in here. So in the night, I can flip that on. And it kind of, you know, brings some vibrance to the room. Got some lights right here to help lit the room because I'm in the basement. And uh, I haven't got all my lighting product yet because I'm trying to buy a whole bunch of stuff. Because upstairs, I didn't need light. I had so much natural light coming through my window. So now, I got to buy lighting and all of this type of stuff. And I don't have the opportunity to do that yet. Because it's, it's, it's going to be shipped from the States. So, I just got to make do with what I got right now. I got one right here. And I got one right there. So, that's basically my room for now, guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Just giving you guys a 360. So you guys can see what's going on. And uh, like I said, hope you guys enjoy this video, man. My room is 70% done. Still got a whole bunch of shelves and stuff to make and add uh, in the room because I'll be getting some cars dolls in the future. Hopefully pretty soon if things goes uh, back to normal real quick. So like I said, thank you guys for tuning in to watch this video and continue to stay safe. And uh, remember, Black Life Matters. It's your boy, Napstar. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Also, follow me on Instagram. I'll pop that up to me. I'll pop that up so you guys can see it. And follow me. And also, let me know in the comments down below what you think of this room and what you think I should add. So, I'm taking, you know, comments from people. Um, pointers, whatever you want to call it. Just let me know in the comments down below. And like I said, it's your boy Napster. Thank you so much. Be safe. Peace.